All right, this is gonna be my before and after video. Right now, this is my stock 98 F-150 with the uh, 4.6 liter V8. Alright, so this might not be the best uh, representation of this lift because uh, my driveway is pretty steep already, so it kind of makes it lean a little harder than it is. Um, but uh, I wasn't smart enough to make a uh, before and after video right when I did this, so I'm going to have to kind of go off of my old footage from when I did my exhaust before and after. But as you can already tell, the front end is a good bit higher than it used to be, and it's kind of making my tire look a lot smaller than you may um, be able to see in the old footage in the front end has a lot more clearance obviously and uh, that's one thing that's cool about these two-wheel drives with a spindle lift is it lifts everything you know it just pushes your tires down so you've got more clearance at the uh, lower control arms and the you know the center of the truck everything is higher not just the, you know, the, the A-arms push down like if you were to crank keys on a full drive. Um, so the spindle is obviously a lot bigger and beefier looking. And the actual position of the uh, rod that sticks out that the everything mounts on, you can see is right at the bottom of it. Whereas on the stock spindle, it's somewhere up in here which I can show you that um, but you see this the um, knuckle I can't even remember what it's called the uh, I feel like an idiot but this little piece where the rotor and bearings and all that sits on is a lot higher you can see that where this hole is in it that's about where it is on the new spindle so that's where you get your lift from um, and so it's very I mean it goes right in doesn't affect anything really a good way to do it with these two-wheel drives. You can see I'm still running 265, 70, 16s, which look pretty small, I'd say, on the truck. I'm thinking about putting some uh, used 35-inch mud grapplers on here just to try, try them out, see how well they fit. As you can see, I've got a good bit of, of clearance, you know, everywhere around the tire. I might have to do some trimming here. Um, for those but judging from the what I've seen online I should be able to fit them with this lift uh, another thing that if somebody's looking to put a lift on this that you need to be aware of is, is it's gonna make the front a lot wider um, it says it would make it like a half inch wider but as you can see they really kind of stick out as with you know most lifts of this you know, this style, you know, it makes the front end stick out a little bit, but I think it's even more so than than they advertised. Oh, so that's something to be aware of. And you may also notice the back is still stock. Uh, most people would put two inch blocks in with this lift, but I um, like the the way the lean look looks on this truck on uh, this body style. That's uh, you know was my desired effect was to get it to sit back like that um, but if you do want a leveled look with the two-wheel drive you're gonna want this lift to get the you know this is probably the best height you can get the three and a half is a pretty is a pretty good lift and the two inch blocks is what I would recommend so um, I'm gonna do some little drive-bys to see how it sits going down the road to compare it to my old footage of when it was stock.
So in conclusion, I just kind of wanted to show you guys the new look and you know, I don't I haven't seen very many videos of something quite exactly like this, especially not with people that only lifted the the front, the the squat thing is kind of a new thing which some people love it or hate it. So I'll leave that up to you. Um looks like it's crooked. That's just my driveway where it's half off the driveway, but um, if you have any questions about my exhaust or anything like that, I do have an exhaust video that you should be able to find if you go to my page. Um, that's still the same setup that it was when I made the video. Um, so yeah, that's that's it. You can see the tire where it sticks out a little bit more up front. Um, but other than that, you know, it's just like what I expected. And I uh, got the look that I was looking for. So if you're thinking about doing this, just uh, let me know if you have any questions. Because I did the install all myself. It wasn't too difficult. So I should be able to help you out. Alright, thanks for watching.